God, the Father of mercies, through the death and resurrection of his Son, has reconciled the world to himself and sent the Holy Spirit among us for the forgiveness of sins. Through the ministry of the church, may God grant you pardon and peace, and I absolve you of all your sins in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Go in peace and sin no more. Is everything okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. I just thought I'd feel better. Give us some time. The feeling will come. Father, it's been six years. I don't think time's going to change anything. Well, God has forgiven you. You told me she has as well. She has. And she strives every day to prove that to me. Well, then maybe it's not her nor God's forgiveness you lack. <sighs> Father, what are you saying? That... that I'm the problem? No, what I'm saying is maybe you haven't forgiven yourself. Thank you, Father. Go on, peace. Listen to me. Forgiveness is not something you earn or deserve. It is a choice. That's what makes it so painful and wonderful. When you forgive someone, it doesn't mean you have to like them or trust them or even be friends with them. But when you choose to forgive yourself, it can be far more difficult because that's a person you must live with and love. God loves you and your wife loves you. And because of that, they choose to forgive you. So if you're wanting to find peace, I suggest you do the same, okay? Okay. Thank you, Father. Go in peace.